All right, so we got Deutschstep race tomorrow, just up there behind me. You can see 10.8 kilometers, 6%. Uh, so I thought I'd just go through my bike. It's pretty similar to what I've been riding before, so there's a video like that, but I made a couple changes, uh, and I'll show you what they are. All right, so up front, we got rid of the little thing here, saved maybe five, 10 grams, because I used up a stem mount because uh, the Wahoo didn't work with the steering tube. Got the most aero little thing here, uh, Wahoo. Probably saves like, 0 0.001 watts, but you know. Uh, I'm, I'm leaving my GoPro mount on, uh, which you can see there. Interesting move, but for me, I just want to record the footage. And, um, you know, I might might pay the price. If I lose by like two seconds, I'll, I'll probably get pretty angry. But anyway, bar tape, I'm gonna leave my bar tape on. I was thinking it was two, one of two things either taking it off, but I think it's quite slippery here. Uh, and to be honest, like, I quite like the change in hand positions. I don't really want to slip off or anything. Uh, so I decided to keep bar tape on. It's pretty heavy bar tape. I probably would say 50 grams. Um, but anyway, I think for me, I'm just going to keep the bar tape on. And so I've got my, my 105 shifters here. Uh, and I've got my Zip uh, SL uh, 70s, which are in 38 centimeter watt bar width. And I think they weigh about 200 grams. Anyway, wheels again, the giant SLR 135 uh, millimeter deep, deep wheels. Pretty good. You can see here. We've got the little Victoria Corsa G Plus, pretty fast tire, about similar speed to the uh, Continental uh, GP4000, uh, but I believe it, they are a little bit lighter. Uh, we now go on to my big change. <laughs> I've taken the bottle cage off, the rear one, and I've also taken off the uh, the pump as well because we will not be needing that. Uh, that should save a little bit of grams. Um, I've left one bottle cage on. I'm going to have a bottle bottle maybe half full of just water. Uh, just to rinse my mouth. I, do, I don't think I'll be drinking very much on that climb particularly because uh, it's not super long. Saddle bag gone uh, and we've got the saddle there uh, which is the stock saddle. I mean it's the giant contact saddle uh, and then rear wheel is the same. Uh, I'll just show you a little bit of the gearing. Alright so for the gearing we've got the 105 5236 as you can see there. Uh, which is pretty good for this climb. Uh, maybe a 50 would almost be better because then you could just go bigger in the whole way. Uh, but generally, I'm going to be in 36 for most of it. And then there's some faster sections where the 52 will be used. Uh, on the back, you can see we have an 1132 cassette here, uh, which is pretty useful. Pretty good in all conditions, really, the 32 cassette. Paired with the Shimano Ortegra R8000 rear derailleur, which can actually hold a 32 cassette, which is pretty interesting. You can see here it's got sort of like a B screw, uh, not a B screw, it's a sort of wolf tooth thing here, which naturally extends it. So that's a that's pretty useful just with that. Uh, and then that's pretty pretty much my whole bike to be honest. Front derailleur as well, 105 5800 going strong. Need to do a little bit of adjustments on that as it's not shifting 100% correctly. Uh, you can see my bike sounds a little bit dirty, but not, not too bad, not too bad. This this is looking pretty clean for my standards. Uh, but yeah, there we go. The weight, about 7.6 kilos, which is not not fair the weight, but it does the job. Maybe that maybe 7.4 now because I've taken off some things. Uh, but yeah, I'm looking forward to the race tomorrow. It's going to be good fun. Oh yeah, calipers 105-5800s again with the giant uh, carbon brake pads. I'm going to be taking these very far out because I don't want any brake rub, so I'm just going to do that. Uh, and yeah, should be a solid race. I'll let you know how I will do. Hopefully we'll manage to get the W, uh, but we will see. Cheers for watching, and I will see you, hopefully, in the next video where I'm on top of the podium.